Man, that floating cup on the left is so good. Hey there everyone, Scout Cow playing uh, Life Goes On. Uh, so I've heard tell that we might just be in the end game already. Like, man, this game just kind of flashing by. Whoa, suddenly Sky Islands. <laughs> Those have been laid a trail of broken buildings and bodies behind them. The nice look skyward. They're the only place they haven't looted yet. They haven't yet looted, sorry. Yeah, so sneaking up on us. Oh, look at that. We got ivy everywhere. We're at a temple, all right. There's stuff going on. Here's some grass. Is Jeff here? Well, time to make some candles. Here we go. Did it. Then we get this thing pretty swell. And then we press this thing. Then we fall. And then we go on this thing. Don't we all? You can go up here if you want to. There's Jeff! To get Jeff, you need to get Jeff! You're gonna feed Jeff whether you want to or not. So, get up here. Get through the soul gate. That's the only thing separating Jeff from lunch. And also possibly being able to navigate up there. Uh, important detail. So I might not be able to do it immediately. Alright, well I just touched you. So, oh boy. All right, what do you do? All right, that's going to be for the end. So our goal, uh, to touch both of those gem uh, soul gates. Those, that's what's going to open up those doors. All right, this is an obstacle. Got it, so... And, uh, I want to go down there to probably do something down there. So we're gonna put that is here, and then we're going to press this button. And then I'm gonna go ahead and fry, and then I'm gonna go here and die. That's the kind of thing we're into, I guess. Um, feels like what I want now is to go up there and go in that battery up there. Like, why not, right? Like, it's there for a reason. I don't see why I didn't go in the middle one quite yet. Oh, there's two batteries here. Okay, that opens up the next battery. Wait, can I take a detour here to go and feed Jeff? You know. Yeah, I'm gonna solve that at a later time. One step at a time. So now I wanna go in the middle thing. Then you press the door indeed. Then we go in this thing. Power of the grief. <laughs> grief power. Here we go. What do you do? What is that? Something that lets you return? Really? So, like, just let's just test it out for a second then. If I do this... And play bad. So if I do this... Okay. So, do I have... So I can do this, for example. No, I can, that's not gonna do anything. But okay. But I feel like that's important, then. Because I need to get up there. Uh, the way to do that is to go here, activate you, do that, and then I can go in a portal this is neat. This is a technology the king has been using to send us on all of our various journeys. It's Jeff! Alright, so now my goal then is to use this to get both of these without dying. Yeah. And that's pretty easy enough to do once everything is in place. Now I'm gonna want to go in this one. And then you hoof it back here. This is neat. This is super neat. Watch out for the spikes. Like, that's not a puzzle spike. That's a... We want to kill you spike. And then 
And I can go venture through force and have an adventure indeed. It's you. Uh, I need to activate you first. And then I. Oh. That's a bit of a bother because I need you up there. Can I turn off the big portal? I sure can. Alright, so that's what I'm going to do then. You just turn it off. Like, simple as that. You go here. Then you look at that machine that at first you didn't really think much about it. Oh, sorry. I need to put you back up. Here we go. And then I'll be up there. That is really cool. Okay. We got ourselves something going, spatially discontinuist! Wow, that was enough for the gold head, too. Just on the par with Jeff! But uh, I'm sure I can include things better. Rake! <laughs> it's useful for... No, I guess you're right. It's pretty much yard work. You can hold it for your sweet choreography. And sweet, awkward, long loading times. Cup of haggling? I don't even know what that means. Alright, so, do I remember how this works? Oh, there's that rake. Good times are had by all. Yeah, here you have to just murder a bunch of people. Alright, so the level isn't exactly... Yeah, I'm just leave it down for now isn't exactly super, super complicated. Like, it's a bit torturous at first because you're running all over the place, but that's fine. I'm gonna go and do you, put you up, accidentally hit the wrong thing. Like, that's kind of like, you know, this is an example where trying to go fast will make you go slower because you know, you're gonna have some incidents here and there. Yeah, you can't go in there. Dang it. Well, now I'm losing lives for no reason. That's fine. Hopefully, I'll make it up time-wise. So now we're gonna go downwards. flap a doodle do Gonna eat a shoe. Alright, good times. Alright, so this is now there. So now we can activate the big portal. Uh, which means we want to go up and down. Wrong one. Um, yeah, I don't even need to die. But, like, I'm there, so... Whatever. Soul jar. Pop. Then we go pop because we can't stop. Here we go. Soldier on down, watch out, there's a spike! Yeah, there's a spike after both, I wonder if that means anything. I don't know. Uh, while I'm here, I'm gonna turn big portal off. While I set this up. Simple as that. My computer fan are jamming. I don't know why they're so loud right now. I guess they're excited about portals, so sorry about that. Then go pop here, and hopefully I have a good time. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to expect. Yay! Jim Fantasite happened! I don't remember it. I got 10 again. Failed a few times. More extra. So, I appreciate the extraness. Look at that. It's Jeff! Alright, interdimensional garbage shoot. That's rude. Don't be rude. Fire and spikes whole bunch of things. This is a really nice place. There's a portal on the thread mill. Um, I don't know where Jeff is. So this powers the thread mill. Alright. You make me go crazy. So if I do that... Yeah, like, that might be key in being able to get up there. I don't know. So you probably... There's Jeff up there. Yeah, you deep out, but that, like, it's kind of funny, because as soon as you die, then that's gonna happen. 
Alright, lots of deaths are happening here by sheer accident. So, like, it looks like like that is kind of a thing where then you, you die and you go like, uh, but you don't make it in time. Maybe it's because I'm not pressing the jump button to summon myself up there fast enough. But see, there I try to jump and just the saddest jump in the universe happened. Ugh. You're not holding on. Like, how else would I go up there? Oh, I'm an idiot. 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 Whoa. You maintain momentum. Yeah, I don't know how I forgot that so quickly. No excuses. What governs these flames? The soul jar down there, it looks like. Alright, let's handle that. I made myself a little body bridge here for fun and profit. Mostly fun. What about this other guy? Right here. I think I need to... Donk a body into it? So I think I need to die to reset the state of a few things. Get you. I just... Uh, get you again. Get you again. Like, there's a... Oh. But like, as soon as I... Battery you... The fire's gonna turn back on. I wonder. Is this a physics thing? I mean, yeah, I can, like... Eh. Or is it? Can I... Launch a corpse in there, I wonder. Like, is that why you're here? Okay, so that's how that's gonna work. If you do that, then you go here. And that happens. And that happens! So now we can go here. Turning off that. Enabling us... To do this. I still don't know what to do about that flame, though. But we can still put a flame in it. Yeah, feels like I might not have figured things out, but wait a second, though. So if there's a flame in there, that's good as long as I don't die. Oh, right. Right, 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 right. Well, there we go. We're getting things done. And I can do that. I can feed Fred. I still don't know how to beat the level, though. Like, that's the funny part. <laughs> it's Jeff. I keep calling you Fred, and I don't know why. I mean, you're fed. Like, how do we solve the problem of getting down there? Is a thing. Because if I put a body there, it's gonna fry. Like, it's gonna die instantly and then fry. Is this the solution? Not really. If we put it here, uh... So if we put it here, and then we give a mighty, a mighty leap. Yeah, see that's exactly what I thought was gonna happen. Oh, but what we can do though, 
Alright, so similar to the Jeff puzzle. Then you go, uh, 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 and now we got a bridge. Uh, I hope that one guy is gonna be enough. It is totally gonna be enough. Okay, got it. Oh man, the sight of ethical treatment of nice. Protest your victim. Well, protest as you will. It's Jeff! All that doable under a minute and a half and with only six bodies. I can believe it. For slightly better wet. Wet slightly better. Slightly better eyesight. It's glasses. Alright, so your main task then seems to be... Alright, let's just have a bridge ready. Uh, the one thing you want to get ready first... Is get all your green. Uh, get all your greens. Because you want this to be done, so that's fine, that's good. Okay, so... So... You want this here. You want this here. I guess you don't need to put anyone there ever? Oh yeah, before you put that flame out. Alright, then you gotta hurry up. Oh, dude, really? That wasn't fast enough? Alright, let's do it again, but this time without that initial hesitation. Dude! That was so fast! Uh, so you're a little at the mercy of how fast this thing goes on the conveyors. A little bit. God damn it. Well, at this point, yeah, I need to restart. Um, well, I've... Like, I did it so easily before. I don't, like, why is this such a struggle now? Well, I just lost a billion lives again because of sheer incompetence. I don't understand. I don't think I have enough time. I'll give it a shot, but... It's like, do I want to do that? So now I'm exactly on par, but I'm not gonna make it time-wise. I guess doing that way would give me time to set up, and then I can return here. And not do it on time anyways. Like, when, what? How, how did I beat this level? Alright. Let's take the time to set up. I have taken the time to set up. So, it's very possible that the one time I did this was a complete fluke. I just kind of... Well, I'm a complete moron. Like, what? What's wrong with me? What's wrong with me? Exactly on par if everything goes well. So you activate this. This is where I want the bodies to flop out from. I gotta go here, press the switch, make the body make a nice bridge for me. I guess I could have went inside the portal to get back here so I didn't have to do that bridge. Wow! Uh it looked so easy, and it felt so easy for a while, and then I just kept tripping up over myself. I don't know how long... This is a weird place. Like, these took a bit. I think I'm going to stop now. The flow may slow down as things are getting a bit more complicated here. 
Oh, like, I don't know. Like, doing the level that normally felt fine, but I somehow I had a more difficult time the second time? It's like flailing around gives you a certain freedom that when you think you know how to do, and that you gotta bunker down. I don't know. It's hard to explain. I don't... Hmm. 